What is good everybody and welcome back and we have a very exciting episode right here We are going to be moving, we are going to be grooving And we are going to be making our way through our NFL season Now four games in this episode, one game will be played Three games will be simulated as we have been tearing it up this season So with that being the case, we're going to try to figure out if we can even get dubs When we simulate, when we don't play, can we win? I say yes because we are that Derrick Henry is like that at QB, but we will see. Now, make sure you guys do smash that thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe. Your boy is back. And I got some collabs coming on the way with your boy K and also the boss and some of the other homies as well. So make sure you guys are locking in because it's going to be lit. Now, Derrick Henry has been going crazy. This man has not played bad at all this season. Well, he has thrown some interceptions. He has been throwing some more interceptions lately than before and also he's been fumbling but you guys have seen the stats right here and tom brady is leading the league in passing yards but in fourth place behind matt Correll, whoever this rookie is derrick henry is there 1467 yards 15 tds and only two interceptions that is not bad at all you are seeing qbr as well you're seeing everything on the board right here um 72 completion percentage but when it comes to qbr we are basically number one you see baker mayfield is number one and all that but these guys haven't even played more than one snap i've been playing the whole season with derrick henry and he has been going off is he the best qb in the nfl i think so but we're going to have to see when the season starts to wind down and see if he's getting that award for the MVP. Now, rushing-wise, Derrick Henry has been going crazy, as you guys are seeing. I mean, his yards are outstanding. He cannot be stopped. Now, when it comes to rushing touchdowns, he is also doing a very good job with five rushing touchdowns. But the fumbles is the issue. Eight. He has 99 carrying, and I have eight fumbles. Clearly... I don't have, you know, game sliders on because I'm fumbling so much. But we got to figure something out right here. Now, receiving-wise, number two, what it do, Robert Woods. I've been trying to tell y'all all season long, Robert Woods has been playing one of, or he has been the best receiver in the NFL in this season for us um, and for the league. And he's obviously number two right now in yards. But he's been going crazy. Number one um, for uh, touchdowns as well. So, what do you guys think about Robert Woods going crazy, doing his thing? Is he the best? I think so. But let's jump to the game right here. And in this game, we are taking on the Buffalo Bills. They are 4-1. and 4-1, and y'all. So, they're going to be a very good team. Josh Allen is a beast quarterback. They have Crowder. Stephon Diggs as well. It's going to be a very good game. And so far, so good. We are going to make sure we get the yards. And we're going to make sure that we also do not get any turnovers. We're going to try our best. But this is what we do the best of. And that's run the ball. We run the rock. And we can't be stopped. Third and four. Hand it off to the running back. Break a tackle and he's going moving dives into the end zone and he does not get there but we are on the one yard line sony michelle is going to be more of a factor now we have been running crazy with derrick henry you guys are seeing a qb sneak right here and he gets himself into the end zone but another thing that we want to do more of is run as a team run as a unit because with that being the case they're not going to know who's running the ball and look at that because Sonny Michelle been running strong. Derrick Henry gets the opportunity to do his thing. And he's breaking tackles left, right, up, down, everywhere. Get out the way, move. We're going to move. We're going to groove. And this right-hand side has been where we've been going off. Should I run the ball more to the left-hand side? Let me know down below. But so far, we are taking advantage of a very good um, blocking on the right-hand side of the field. Now, across the middle, there is nobody there to guard Austin Hooper, a TD for us. He gonna jump into the crowd. He gonna get lit with the fans. And I mean, Tennessee's, they're, they're going crazy in the, uh, in, the, in the stadium right now. Undefeated team, one of the best teams, if not the best team in the league right now. How are you not gonna be happy? Another pass and another touchdown to who? Austin Hooper, signature between the legs, layup. That man is a baller. Second and five, we are going to keep the drive alive big time. Breaking tackles, doing our thing. This is incredible. 
When I say incredible, I mean it. Sony Michelle running the ball, catching the ball. I'm telling you, we're going to get him more involved because he is a versatile, dual threat type of uh, player. He can run and he can catch. And this guy right here, he can do it all. Let's go. TDs all day. A big rushing touchdown for Derek Henry. Henry. But that kind of rhyme when I say Henry all day. You feel me? 27 to 3. That is what. Oh my gosh. Yo. A pick six. Michael Hyde is there. And he said, it's my turn to step up for the team. 27 to 10. They're down by 17. So we're still a very good spot. Oh my goodness. Show off your arm strength. That's how we do it. That's how we play. We got weapons all day, man. All day. Second and 16. What do you mean? Oh, my gosh. Michael Hyde is everywhere. That's his second pick on the day. In this third quarter as well. Good block and we gone. Break that. Let's go. And we gone. Go, let's go. Let's go. Oh. We going crazy, man. Hand the ball off. Look at Sony Michelle. Cutting to the left. Cutting to the right. Him and our backup running back Hillard, or I think it's Hillard, have been splitting the carries because both of them have been playing well. And with that being the case, I mean, you're seeing Michelle been going crazy. 34 to 16. What do you mean? Kick is up. Kick is good. Straight down the middle. Add three points to that. Man. 37 is the score. Third and inches across the middle. We find Hooper. Block for your boy. Break a tackle, and he does. Keep going, and he does fight for extra yards. Let's continue to ball. Let's continue to play football. Scramble, end zone, untouched. You know what it is. You know who it is. DH, Derek, Henry, all day up by 14. Now, we are, yes, up by 14, but we have to make... Okay, there he goes. Sure, that... Boom! Derrick Henry, hold up, has broken the single-game rushing record in the NFL. He has over 300 yards. Over 300. Record breaking. Record breaking performance, and then I throw another pick. That's three picks today with Derrick Henry. But luckily, our defense is doing all right. I mean, giving up 30 points is not good, but at least they're not giving up touchdowns every single time because the Bills have chances to come back, and they haven't done their thing. But that being the case, though, fourth and one, we run the ball right here because we had the faith that we would be able to, you know, pick it up and end this game. No more timeouts. Under 30 seconds left, and look who it is in the end zone once again. The man with the plan, Derrick Henry. The single game, single season rushing record, over 300 yards. Thank you, come again. Dubs all day. You're seeing stats right here. Derrick Henry did not have his best game. 250 yards, three touchdowns, three picks. Josh Allen had no picks, and he did throw two touchdowns, but it was not enough. So you guys are seeing though, like QBR under 100, that's not uh, normal for us as well. Um, but we did focus on running. You guys are seeing that. 312 yards. That is the most ever in one game. 23 rushes. You're also seeing Sony Michelle had 68 yards on 10 carries. Four touchdowns for Derrick Henry as well. So he had seven total. Incredible. Fantastic. He's the MVP, man. I don't care. Three picks. I don't care. He's the MVP. What do you think? Hashtag. Put a hashtag and put... You know what? Hashtag MVP Derrick Henry if you think he deserves that. Now, receiving-wise, the Buffalo Bills have weapons, bro. Crowder had over 100 yards, 120 to be exact, on eight catches and a touchdown. Um, Keelan Cole had five catches, 99 yards and a touchdown. And then Hooper had two touchdowns. And then Will Fuller had, what do you have, 27 yards. So uh, the ball was spread around, and we did a very good job. Now, we're going to be simming three games because we've been cooking, 
and I do want to make it further in the season to, uh, you know, see what's kind of going on and get to the playoffs. So with that being the case, Chiefs, Colts, Rams, all will be simulated. And we're going to sim this Chiefs game um, right here. So we get the dub. 31-28 is the final score, and we won by three. Um, let's check out the stats right here. You are seeing Derrick Henry also, or not also, but once again, did not have the best passing game. Two TDs, two picks, 81.3 QBR. That is not good. Sonny Michelle's running the ball well, though. Two touchdowns, 19 carries, 79 yards. And you guys are seeing um, only two carries and 11 yards for Derrick Henry. Now, when I sim, that's the only problem. It's going to mess up my stats because I could be going crazy with the stats and, you know what I'm saying, uh, getting more rushing yards and passing yards with the case being that I am simulating some of these games we're gonna miss out on breaking records but it's all good game number two that was simming versus the Colts and we lose we lose I almost said got the dub we only scored seven points Derrick Henry only 91 yards and a touchdown am I seeing this right I might need glasses, y'all. Sony Michelle ran the ball well again, but no touchdowns. 19 carries for 75 yards. What is going on? Why didn't they throw the ball more? Why didn't they run the ball more with the best player in the NFL? Receiving-wise, Paris Campbell... One touchdown on three catches. That was a mess. Okay, so Rams, we caught another L. 24 to 21. What happened here? 300 yards from Derrick Henry passing. No touchdowns, no picks. 300 yards and no touchdowns. Wow, that's incredible. Cam Akers had no touchdowns as well. He ran the ball well for 81 yards. Um, Sony Michelle had 60 yards. Derrick Henry had where is he two rushes for 15 yards we're not gonna win if derrick henry is not going crazy when i sim it's seeming to be the case that derrick henry is not going crazy and i'm not too happy about that but with that being the case we have made it all the way to week number 10 and we will be taking on the saints i will sim games in the next episode as well as we are going to move and groove through this series but i hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did smash that thumbs up let me know if you want to see any specific stats in the next episode and i will show those um but yeah hope you guys enjoyed i'm gonna see y'all very soon and i am out